we've got a little wall to eight. Just enough time to catch you up on the story. It's simply love that Brooke Moroldi and husband Greg Ryan feel for their East Nashville neighborhood. The energy was great here and also found the people really welcoming. They just moved here in November and this place was becoming home when a night in March came and Brooke got a warning on her phone. Get shelter now. This is what the tornado did to Brooke and Greg's neighborhood in seconds. I remember that feeling of this is big and I remember a resolve. We're gonna be okay. We're gonna be okay. The houses that you see are actually the ones that survive. Those windows there, my office, basically that tree. Yeah, pretty significant damage, but we're okay. We're okay. After eight long weeks of repairs, Brooke and Greg could return to that neighborhood they love. But in coming home, they heard the neighbors up to something. Something it's now time to show you at the stroke of eight. We were like, sure, let's howl. The Nashville 8 o'clock howl. Some howl to let out stress from the pandemic. Some howl to honor hospital workers in the city. Tornado, COVID, uncertainty. To get out and howl was so liberating. Organized by people on Facebook, this is the final official howl. Though it might just continue on its own. Good one. Even though this was the tree that smashed through my office, the tree symbolizes the heart of Nashville. We're not going to stop howling. <laughs> We're going to keep howling. That's all there is. <laughs>